So if communication will help protect your kids against bullies, how do we develop our communication skills? I think first off, we have to work on developing closeness. We need great communication not just to protect against bullies, but to protect against bad philosophies of life. So how can we develop that tight relationship? Listen in again to Coach Michael Burt. If you don't have a close relationship with your children, somebody else will. Don't you want it to be you? If you don't have a close relationship with your child, then somebody else will. Somebody else will influence your child positively or negatively. Now, I want you to think about that from the coach's perspective. If I spent five and a half hours a day, Jesse, with your children, then, then you would be sure to need to know what my philosophy was on growing people. Because think of how deeply I am embedding my philosophy into the fabric of their DNA, the software that I'm giving them. That's why it's important that I taught my players the seven habits of highly effective people, the principles of good to great, the five dysfunctions of teams, the power of intention, how to become a category of one. I was implanting this in my players. And because of that, 100% of my players went to college that played for me for four years. 100%, not 90%, not 98%. And so you ask me, does everybody have to go to college to be successful? No, but it is a foundation. The biggest time that your kid is influenced away from you is at school. Do you know what's going on at school? And how can you protect your kid if you don't know what's happening at school? 